Chilltown is on a little mission right now called Operation Double Date. On Big Brother, scheming contestants are locked in a house where they vote to evict each other until one lucky soul is left to win the half-million-dollar prize. And no one's played the game more ruthlessly than season two buddies Mike Boogie Mellon and Dr. Will Kirby. You look like a human on the outside, but it's just skin over circuitry and wires. <laughs> you are the evil doctor. The guys formed the Chilltown Alliance and plotted their way deep into the game. Maybe she wants to go. Now you're talking. <laughs> right or wrong, I like that attitude. Though Mike was evicted, Will made it to the last round. Sure enough, the devilish doctor took home the jackpot. You played an excellent game, Will, and I voted for you, baby. Congratulations. Yeah, baby. Yeah. All right, I just have to make it official. Congratulations, Will. You are the winner of Big Brother 2. Five years later, the gruesome twosome reunited for Big Brother All-Stars, and the Chilltown conspiracy was reborn. This time, Mike won and got a cool half a mil for his troubles. Mike, congratulations with both words. You are the winner. So where are Dr. Will and Mike Boogie now? Hey, we're here in front of Dolce, the Italian restaurant. We opened in 2003 with celebrity investors such as Ashton Kutcher, Wilmer Valderrama, Danny Masterson, Will Kirby. Why don't we go inside for a drink? Maybe a little pasta? Are you up for it? Mike is a big shot in L.A.'s restaurant and club scene. Everybody in Hollywood hangs out at my restaurants and nightclubs. Brittany, Paris, Lindsay, Ashley Simpson. I mean, you name it, they come out. And Will, a successful cosmetic dermatologist by day, is right by his side. Give me the updates on the restaurants. What's happening with that? Will had some money left over from his big win on Big Brother 2, so I went to him and said, hey, why don't you put a little money in my first restaurant? And he happily did, and I made him a lot of money. Gage House Atlanta is going to open in uh, two weeks. Awesome. Dolce down there is doing great. When things go well, I take credit for it, and when they go terrible, I'm just a small investor. Some nights he owns a fork, some nights he built the whole place by hand. We roll with it. Mike's not the only Chilltown entrepreneur. Will's also launching a business and making the world a prettier place. One of the things that I'm most proud of, which I'll brag for a second, even though it's very unlike me, is that I'm starting my own skincare line. It's called Kirby Cosmeceuticals. In addition to Will investing in my restaurants, I've invested in his cosmeceutical and tattoo removal businesses. It really strengthens our friendship that we would be willing to part with our finances to support each other's endeavors. But the best part of Chilltown's reality experience could be this. Will made a new word, showmance. A showmance is when you have a romance on a reality show. It's not for real. I am so adamant that this is going to be a common reality phrase that I have since copywritten showmance. Anyone who uses this phrase without my express written consent will be sued. So, showmance, I can say it, you can't. Now, with Big Brother behind them, Mike and Will can reflect on their legacy. Chilltown is not one of the best alliances in reality TV history. It's the best alliance. Every goal we set, we made come true. Being a villain on the show was a lot of fun. But I think we've both moved on, and we don't define ourselves by reality TV. I think the thing that, you know, I'll look back on and be somewhat proud of is that reality TV totally changed the landscape of television, and we were a big part of that. Chilltown is 